Stewart, both the police and fire chief told me today that this new system has the potential to shave precious seconds off their response times. Also, it will ultimately give us, the public, an alternative way to contact 911. 911, what's the location of your emergency? Following the Pulse nightclub shooting, Orlando is a city that knows all too well the critical need for the most accurate information being shared quickly among first responders. Today, the city's police and fire chief set side by side as the city council approved spending $1.9 million for a state-of-the-art dispatch system. Currently, police and fire dispatchers work in the same room at the emergency operations center, but they work on separate platforms that don't share data. The new system will allow both agencies to share one platform and shave crucial seconds off their response. Picture yourself getting a group text message. Um, both, both people in the group get the information at the exact same time, and that's exactly what this new computer-aided dispatch system allows for. Eventually, the new system will also allow dispatchers to send first responders live feeds from video cameras and even drones. Once you have that type of live footage, for example, if it's a domestic disturbance where you have a large crowd is gathering to know exactly what's happening, our crews know how to stage accordingly. But perhaps most helpful will be the ability for the public to text 911. Currently in Orlando, if you do text 911, you get a message saying that service is not available. It's an option that could have been helpful in the pulse shooting, where victims whispered into their phones for fear the shooter might hear them. Now, this new system will take eight to nine months to build out, and at this point, there's no hard date for when the text to 911 option will be active here in Orlando. Currently, you can text 911 in Osceola County, and Orange County has said it hoped to have that option active at some point this year. Live in Orlando, Amanda Oberwesch, 2 News.